All right, so now we're going to learn about the for each. So um, what I'm gonna do is just copy the count because they're kind of similar, okay? Uh, and so what I'll do is create a new file here and we'll call this main.tf. We'll paste in the contents here. So the difference is that instead of using a count, what we're gonna do is use an object to iterate through and change, you know, some particular properties. So what we can do is maybe change the size of the instance. So we say nano micro might be an example here. T2 micro, T2 uh, micro, I should have made the first one nano there. And I could even do a small, I suppose. And so instead of the instance type um, being set here, what we're going to do is just say uh, each dot value. And then for the server name, we'll do each dot key. Now, this splat's not going to work for um, a map because that's what this is. This is a map data structure and splats only really work with lists. So what we can do is use the values function to extract because this, this would return if you just had this my server, this is going to be a, a map. OK, so what we can do is just put the parentheses around here and that will turn into a list. Um, at just the values, and then we should be able to get our public IP address that way, I think. So what we'll do is make sure we're in the right folder first. That's always important. Tell you how many times I messed that up. We'll do our Terraform init to get things going. And, you know, we might not even necessarily need to apply this as long as the plan looks good. Because if this was not correct, this part here would probably error out. Like, I definitely would. Okay, but we just want to see that when we do a plan that this, that this is correct. Great. So what we'll do here is now type in Terraform plan. And so we have an error here. I think it's because it's supposed to be values, not value. So I'll just correct that there. And these are all like built in functions. So we go to while we're waiting for that plan to generate there, I'll try to show this to you quickly built in functions not here. So we would just type in Terraform built in functions. And probably under collections, that's where these things become very useful these all these functions here. And so values is the one we just use here for the map. So I'm sure there's other ones that would uh, come into play. So now if we just scroll up, what I want to see is that we have three instances. So notice here, the public IP is going to give us three back, which looks correct to me. The first one is server small. Notice that it's a T2 small. We have our, oh, this is T2 small as well. Nano, and then that's a small. Hmm. And if we go up to this one here, this is micro. So micro, that makes sense. Maybe I just entered the value incorrectly and maybe you're watching me this entire time. Yeah, I did. So this is just supposed to be nano up here. And so we'll run that again. I have to say, I really don't like how plans are laid out. I find them a little bit hard to read, but um, I guess it's just the level of complexity you have. So there's not a, a lot of ways around that. So we have the T2 small the T2 nano and the uh, T2 micro. Notice it doesn't really respect the ordering of this. They're all just kind of there in the plan. But yeah, so that would definitely work. I, I'm not going to run this. I'm going to consider this done and we can move on to the next part here. Okay.